because I was just thinking, uh, I don't know why I don't like cyber truck every time I see one, I just what is America finna do next? Like, chill out, Elon. Somebody actually stalking me. Let me just turn this in because that's still harassment. Like, you're sending me my name, my number, and my address, and then you're sending me a PDF of a picture of a picture of something near to my house and being like, oh, does this look familiar? Like, you're crazy they sent a whole pdf like i'm not even gonna show y'all but it's like blackmailing i feel so bad for you guys because karma's a bitch and you ran into the right one. Oh, i'm kind of hey. time to get this workout <laughs> here's all my information i'm just playing thank you Your girl night ellie if you're new to my channel welcome to my channel and make sure to click that subscribe button and join me today is going to be a get ready with me and i may not even start out my video with this clip i'm just trying you know trial and error i'm picking up my check right now and i haven't been set up for a direct deposit because i just recently transferred to a whole new agency that i work for you know like that whole process has been just all over the place and y'all yes this is how my skin naturally looks and i know i always bring it up but only because I realize like I'm very self-conscious about it and I feel like if I'm what makes me feel comfortable is when I let it be known that I know do you get what I'm saying like I don't know why like as soon as I say tell somebody like oh like you know my skin like don't mind my skin then I feel more secure that within itself makes me feel more secure which is so weird like I try to think like why am I like that but I am so anyways i was thinking like maybe that should be like my next video that i talk about because i love this little sit down talking thing that i'm doing now i think i'm gonna sit down and take notes on insecurities and like my perception on insecurities and or how i usually deal with my insecurities because you know every single person on this earth is insecure there's not one person that's there's i don't know why that distracted me there's not one person that's not insecure like you know but yeah like i said right now i'm just oh by the way i'm filming on a phone because i'm just sick and tired i hate when she get wobbly in these fucking streets when i start vlogging because i asked you guys what did you guys want to see and you guys said like get ready with me vlog um i think i saw somebody say like a haul which i have all of those things coming in this one video so i'm filming off of my phone because if you know then you know my camera overheats dies whatever blah blah, blah. it's only meant for like sit down occasions it's not really meant for vlogging or taking it out it cannot even handle one second of the sun it automatically starts overheating let alone my freaking ring light sorry if this is shaky like i'm trying to figure out everywhere that i go or live it's construction everywhere and they don't be fixing shit they just be making shit worse anyways Recently, I got back into working with this thrifting app that I really, really like. I've worked with them twice already, and I have to make videos for them, so that's one of the things I'm gonna do when I get home. Oh, I have to pick up my mom literally right after this. I have to go straight to pick up my mom. Oh, I'm, I'm fucking lying, no I don't. Low key, I do, but not really. So yeah, maybe I'll quickly go home, do my makeup a little bit, and then get my mom, come back home, start on the videos, and then go to the gym so that's today's today's to-do list one of the things that i wanted to touch up on when it comes to like insecurities not even just insecurities but like things occurring in your life in the way that you see your life literally in the physical is like you the things that you say so i just want to let it be known that from now on i'm rich as fuck i have all the money in the world i'm financially stable i am so happy i barely i don't go through anything most of the time like i'm straight like literally and i just i love the way i look all the time i think i look great i think i look amazing like I, i'm so in love with everything see that's how you need to talk to yourself and i'm not just saying that about insecurities so stay tuned for this video because i'm going I, like i said i come with experience receipts everything everything i'm not just saying because it's like off the dome no i literally from experience and what i think my experience teaches me so i'm gonna be doing that from now on my videos are gonna be something like that so because i was just thinking uh i don't know why i don't like cyber truck every time i see one i just i just start thinking like what is america finna do next like chill out elon like come on like for real bro like i'm not even kidding 
every time I see a cyber truck, I just think like, yeah, we're doomed. Like I just see the future in that and I just don't, uh, the future of America, nobody knows it. That's just gonna go down the fucking drain. I hate when people fucking stare at me too, bitch. Don't fucking stare at me. <laughs> Sorry, let me stop. Let me stop being rude. I really don't like it when people stare at me because um, I just don't see the point in staring at me, especially if I don't know you. Like, okay, look at me, but not for too long. Like if you're like, look away because I've realized that lately I will say things and even throughout my whole life I will say things and they will happen you know how they say spelling and your words are spells I don't think I take it like that like no f like potions and shit with your word no I think it's literally just the power of the tongue like your voice and the way that you voice and word yourself and the way that you speak about yourself you speak on others you speak about life whatever it is that you're speaking on the way that you speak about it the way that you speak about it becomes it becomes and it doesn't even have to just start to become in the physical just yet it becomes it in your mind why are you staring at me clearly i do not want nothing to do with you i literally wish i was kidding when i say that this it was a man the first i don't know why i want to talk about it but like in the first clip he was like on not on the lane next to me the lane next to the lane that was next to me before the car came in between us he literally was like this like staring at me mad like hard and i don't have tinted windows <clears throat> so i was just kind of just like that was my first reaction I kid you not, this car drives past me. While driving, he had his window down on his side. He turns his head and while driving. Like it's never that serious. Mind you, I'm I'm over here trying to make a video. You don't think that makes me feel uncomfortable? I, I, I don't really get people be talking about, oh, I was just looking at you because you look pretty or something or whatever. I, mean, I don't know what he was looking at. Don't do that. Don't do that. Anyways. This is one of the things that has been irking me recently. It irks me. Like, come on. Like, just looking. Like, damn. I'm sorry, guys. I really don't like that. Do not stare at me. Especially when I'm driving. Like, come on. Maybe I just want to chill, be on my phone, and then you, you just a motherfucker just like this. Like, bitch, stop doing that dumb shit. I'm cussing too much. Sorry, guys. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. It becomes. It becomes. And not just in your physical just yet. It becomes it in your mind first. And then it becomes it in your physical. Start speaking. That's why you guys saw me saying I'm rich as f I'm this, I'm that. Like, I'm really just going to start saying it. Even if I don't see it. Even if it's not. No, I'm I'm straight, bro. Like, I'm literally as perfect as I can be. I'm, I'm like the best me I can ever be. That's what I was saying on that. And then I was going to say something else and I forgot. It must have not been that important anyways. So I will see you guys in my creator's room when I'm back home. I don't think I'm going to take y'all with me to get my mom just because why would I do that? Oh, look at my eyes. I did my lashes. Do they look good? Okay, so I'm back home now and I'm just going to be covering the little marks on my face with a little bit of makeup because, you know, for a, there's a time and a place for everything, you know, with this promotional video. I don't think I would just let my face, at least that's just me, I wouldn't. So we're going to cover it up. I'm mixing this foundation because like I've had to stop using just concealer. Now I have to use foundation as well because it's so much more coverage that I need to go through. But I mix this e.l.f. concealer with this um, Fit Me foundation because it's too dark. My shade right now is off because like if you know, when you have my type of skin tone, when that winter time starts to come, my skin has been getting light because I haven't been getting sun recently. I think I need to go to the beach soon or something. Just to get, I should tie my hair back. I don't know why. I didn't think about that. I have a lot of redness and darkness. And I know this looks light, but it's because my skin is light, y'all. Like when I blend it in, y'all will see what I'm talking about. As soon as I do my, my under eyes, I think I'll be good. But yeah, so what's the next step? I've been forgetting my steps. Oh, so let's do some concealer. So to conceal, I'm gonna go even lighter, which is this Lancome right here, but I'm gonna mix it with a little bit of this NARS cause it is just a little bit too light. This one is like way lighter, you'll see. See how that's like way lighter? And I've noticed that like when you bring it down right here, it makes a big difference. I was gonna say something. 
y'all you know what's been going on recently i've been getting these emails and it's only through my business email which is the weirdest like the most weirdest thing but it, it'll be like this email where it'll be sending me my name my address and my number right i've already gotten this twice from two different emails and two different names again on my business email so it'll send me my name my address and my number and i'm like what the f like why are you sending me my own information like i already don't know myself like what so it's just weird so i click on it and then when i click on it there's immediately a pdf and in the pdf it's just a whole literally a whole paragraph of a picture of where i live but you could tell it's all like on google maps it's basically just like a whole pdf talking literally talking smack like talking shit I need to, I want to learn how to stop cussing, so I'm trying to, like, teach myself that a little bit. Or, like, you know, not, um, like, all the way stop cussing, but just, like, you know. The PDF is basically, like, trying to scare you into blackmail. It's literally saying, like, oh, I've been, it, this one specific line I took from the whole PDF. It's like, I've been following your pathetic life for so long. I've been watching your every single move. I have deets on you, I have videos of you. But then it goes to talking about how it has videos and I know they're sending this to multiple people because it was literally a copy and paste from one email to another email that they sent to my business email. So I was like, bruh, it was basically saying like, oh, those sites you watch, I see you uh, watch there. Um, and the way you set up your phone, nice setup by the way, basically insinuating that I watch porn and uh, and that I be touching myself while watching it and that I set up my phone and sh I'm like, first of all, all my due diligence, whatever the f word it is, everything that I do, I do it in the shower. I don't do that sh in my room. I don't ever do it like with my phone. Like I, I be in my head my imagination does the work itself i don't really need a phone or something to look at to do that you know i just be thinking like so immediately i was like who are they talking about because you don't got none of that on me because baby i don't even be doing that so then i was just confused the first time i got this email but then i was like i was kind of like let me turn this into the sheriff's office because even though i'm not scared and i know that this has nothing to do with like an actual thing that's gonna happen or like somebody actually stalking me. Let me just turn this in because that's still harassment. Like you're sending me my name, my number and my address and then you're sending me a PDF of a picture, of a picture of something near to my house and being like, oh, does this look familiar? Like you're crazy. I'm like, I'm already knowing these are scammers or people trying to get money. Cause it's like, if you if if you don't want me to expose you and send this to your whole contact list, then um then send me this much and it's in bitcoins it's like send me this this much in bitcoins i'm like baby this this screams scam <laughs> scammer all over it i'm just like how far are people going to to get money now like how bummy are we getting in this world i'm sorry if you're a scammer you're a bum you're a bum oh let me not say that because <laughs> one of my really good friends is a scammer but um Hey, the truth is the truth. It's a bum in the sense of you want the easy way out in life and you're literally jeopardizing your whole life. But you know, I don't know, bruh. It is what it is. I can't, I can't sit around and lie. Like, you know, like at one point you have to understand that you're stealing people's hard work a uh, hard earned money or if not if you're not stealing people's hard earned money then you're just like putting fake money into their account and then when you suck it out and they're not able to pay it back you're messing with their credit you're messing with their bank statements you're messing with everything and it just messes with people's lives so again the easy way out but it's just so sad i sent an email back and i think i want to read it to you guys i would show y'all the email but it has my information on it so i'm not gonna do that i'm gonna read y'all what i said back so the first one that sent me one it was from dean gong like what and then the second one was sent from ren renski megna again just what the f so this is the this is the pdf basically they sent a whole pdf like i'm not even gonna show y'all but it's like blackmailing and they did this twice on two different on two different emails i said i said you guys have hit me through several several different hold on let me let me get myself ready i said you guys have hit me up through several different emails and have all been reported to the police it's not hard to reach you guys at all lmao it's not your ip address is not that hard to reach it's kind of sad what money does to people like you it's actually disgusting 
you never know what somebody could be going through and you'll suck all of their money out of them when they have families to feed and bills to pay and actually work for their hard-earned money unlike bums like you i hope you analyze yourselves and understand that to get money you need to work not steal and definitely not try to blackmail i feel so bad for you guys because karma's a bitch and you ran into the right one you will also be charged for having people's information and harassing them by sending them pictures of their neighborhood through google maps in all honesty i pray for you and whoever else is doing this to learn and heal because it's sad god bless and good luck I said what i said the fuck so yeah but anyways because that kind of just like i kind of was like what the like honestly i was sitting there what in the world oh yeah and i bring that up and you know what's so crazy now that i think about it it was only specifically these two different emails was through my business email right it wasn't through my regular email so i don't know if this is something that's happening like collectively to a bunch of people because i've only ever used my business email to do like promotions anything that has to do with whatever i'm doing for like work getting money which has always been for like promotions and stuff like that. So how, however they got my information had to be through some type of a promotion, you know what I mean? And I recently just stopped working, not recently, like, well, yeah, recently. I stopped working with this management company that I signed a contract with. And let me tell you, bruh, those people owe me money. They owe me money. I made videos for them and the i'm sorry look let me let me say their name because here's one thing about it you will get exposed heinz management so it's specifically spelled h-e-i-s-m-a-n-m-g-m-t dot com those people don't mess with those people i made videos for them i sent them videos and they did not pay me all the money that they owe me they still owe me money specifically like the, the guy that was working with me through my messages this is why you don't ever play with people's pockets because imagine if i blow up or if i get big oh i'm gonna say it again this video then people gonna see it again if i really get exposure and then i'm gonna make sure people don't ever mess with you trust and believe you will never get past me never get past me do me dirty i will let it be known don't ever do me dirty bitch. but yeah so heinz management don't mess with them people but that's why i was thinking about it because i was like could it be something that has to do with promos because now that i'm connecting the dots it was only through my business email that's weird this is as much covering as i'm gonna do and i'm not even gonna use powder or setting spray because my face is really dry right now regardless but i will do some lip liner and put my retainers on and then i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the boxes and the stuff that i have to wear and then i'm gonna make the video and we'll get ready to go to the gym let me do my lip liner while y'all are here though it's just crazy the stuff that's going on right now it's so crazy and to me i think it's so sad and you know what like i really try to be nice but recently i can't i can't be nice like as much as i used to be don't get me wrong i still choose kindness and like being good and i still try to think the best way i possibly can in a situation but recently i'm like i'm tired of being not tired of being the bigger person but i'm tired of like trying to see the good and everything something bad is happening to me and just being like oh i'll let it slide because the answer is love recently i have not been in that energy i'm just like no oh by the way y'all i ended up going out again but nothing happened but yeah, I just couldn't stay home. But this time I didn't drive and I didn't take my car. So Loki, you know, like I was like, okay, everything going good, everything going all right. Alrighty y'all, so this is the end of look. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna put my retainers on and then we'll get into the rest of this video. So here are, ooh, let's not do that. Here are the bags. So with these, okay, so when I work with Jambo, because I've worked with them, three this is my third time working with them so usually when i work with them they give me like three hundred dollars on their app and then i buy whatever i want and um you know i make a video about it and i promote them so but this time they only gave me 150 in advance and then the two videos and then they give me the other 150 so i wanted to take this time to change my style or like you know you know how y'all was saying y'all wanted a haul matter of fact 
uh this is sidetrack i have a whole box right there of sheen clothes but it's more of like dressy the dressy kind of switch that i want to do because y'all i threw away a bunch of clothes in my closet not threw away but i put it away in a bag <clears throat> it was so random too i was like i'm changing my wardrobe so that in there is the dressy more like sade kind of vibe i'm trying to go for so i can try that on in a video with y'all and i will soon this is more of like the casual switch that i'm trying to go for so this is like baggy low-rise jeans just because i'm noticing that like it fits my body more like low-rise loose things or not too loose because i love tight clothes but like low rise things because I have a short waist. But anyways, I wanted to take this time to go ahead and do that transition. So I don't have to waste my own actual money. I can just experiment with this money. So it was like a win-win, you know what I'm saying? Um, So I'm really like nervous about trying these jeans on. Especially since I have to promote this. Like what if I don't like it? I'm not finna lie. So, but I did get a bag and I already opened it. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie, Jambo really is good though. Even if I was buying with my own money, like that's still a steal. I got a BB bag, brand new. It was $89 and I got it for, well, I didn't get it, but you know, it was running for $35. So that's like hella money saved. And it was like brand spanking new. I'm gonna go finish the Jambo banana. Actually, I meant to mention, I also got this OQQ, which is like workout clothes, which, hey, surprise, surprise. I didn't even ask or do a promo with them again. They just sent me another one. I guess I'm on their PR list. Like, I really don't know. This is so random. So I'm excited. I'm going to open this up with y'all too. I'm thinking it's going to be, um, a, what's it called? Like workout clothes. Because the last time I got something from OQQ and did work with them, it was workout clothes. So I'll see. We'll see what this is about. Okay, so I'm back. I don't like that glitter. So I'm back and I think I'm just gonna tell you guys to go watch the Jumbo video on my TikTok if you guys wanna see that because I don't feel like doing that. But we will do this one on here since this one is unexpected. Again, this is for, I'm not gonna lie y'all, we finna turn the air on, it is hot. So this is it and it says, she made it, spring summer fashion show. Oh, I'm kinda, I'm not a pattern girl. Oh, they gave me like multiple y'all. Should I try it on with y'all? This is the first thing. Oh, this is like a little bag. Okay. I think this is so cute. Look at that. I like that. I think they used their extra cloth and just made it into bags, which is pretty freaking smart. Oh, she's cute. That is cute. I would wear this even as a bikini. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Should I try it on? I'm not gonna try it on because this is like a one piece and I, I didn't even shave. Sorry if that was TMI, it's the truth. Yes. Tell me why I was just thinking I need some more uh, leggings for the gym because I don't feel like shaving my legs frequently, especially now since um, the summer, the summer's coming, the winter's coming and you know, what I gotta shave my legs for, so. Hey, and it's the scrunch one. My booty finna be looking. Hey. Um, should I try these on? Should I wear this just? In dedication for today's video but i finally shaved my legs so i kind of don't want to wear this today i kind of want to wear my shorts and do leg day today so all right let me stop and let me try oh this is cute this is freaking cute and i'm not even a skirt girly but this is so cute y'all i'm trying i'm trying those on i'm gonna try those on just for y'all just for y'all I think I'm gonna try on the skirt and I'm gonna try on the leggings for y'all on here. I'm gonna just do it while talking to y'all because y'all can't see the bottom part of me. So I'm actually going to really force myself to go to the gym. It is currently, what time? It's about to be 12. Now, let me tell you, I do not work tomorrow, so that's good. However, I do have to take my mom to my grand, my grandparents, fuck, I can't talk. I do have to take my mom to my grandparents' house tomorrow because she has to take them to the airport. So I still have to be up early, um, but I'm kind of just like trying to prove to myself that I can still get things done and that like, you know, time is just an illusion and I'm just playing. But no, for real, like as soon as I finish taking her over there, I can just come back home and get some rest. So it's not really about, yeah, bro, these are long too. Fit my whole leg. That's a rare occasion for me. Let me tell you that one. I will say one thing. I don't like how high-waisted these are, and they are a bit see-through. I don't like how high-waisted these are. I probably I really don't like these. I'm not gonna lie to you. So, do you see what I mean by how high-waisted these are? Now, of course, the, the back looks good, but y'all can't see. I'm gonna just have to show y'all like this. 
Like, do y'all see that? I am not with that. Don't like it. Let's do the skirt now. Okay, this isn't even that bad. This is cute, y'all. And I love how it has shorts at the bottom, so I don't feel insecure. Because it has shorts. I could... I could do all that and still feel secure. I love this. The skirt is a win, y'all. Now, obviously, I wouldn't wear it with this shirt. But look, it's so cute. And it has a shorts up on the bottom. So I don't have to worry about... Okay, she's cute. She's cute. She's cute. So now it's time to get ready to go to the gym, y'all. We're just gonna have the whole car ride together. Should I film in there? Should I film in there just a little bit? Just a little bit. I'm gonna go get ready for the gym and we will go into the car. Y'all, I'm in my car. Let me tell you that when I walked in here, there was a freaking spider, bro. Not in my car, but like on the outside on this side. And I just hope it goes away while I drive because I'm not going to get on, out on that side then. Now I'm starting to like, you know, when you feel shivers all over your body. I hate that. I'm just trying to focus on driving. I'm not trying to focus on the dunk. Oh, yeah. I have to put my... So yeah, it's literally about to be one, but thank God my Planet Fitness is 24 hours, so I don't gotta worry about that shit. A little background music, I don't wanna get copyrighted though, so let me turn that off. My thing is like that spider needs to go. Damn, that's crazy. It's so different going from a camera to a phone, like an actual camera to a phone. Yeah, anyways, uh, oh fuck, I forgot to. So y'all, yeah, I'd be doing like, I'm gonna stop here at this red light. I'd be doing like um, energy drinks before the gym, but I'll do the packet ones. I think I already told y'all that, but I, I can't really remember. But I usually have to drink it like a few minutes before getting to the gym so it can already kick in my system as soon as I'm there. And I could just work out without having to stop and take a sip every day. Hopefully there's not a lot of people there. So is this the one with the empty ones in it? Or the one with the good ones in it? So I just be getting these packets right here. And then it's just simple. Look at that. Hurry up before so this light turns green. And it doesn't even have as much color as you would expect it to. I think I can go now. Yeah. I forgot I still have makeup on. Am I tripping or did somebody just beep? There's not even that many cars for somebody to beep, so I'm confused. But anyways, yeah, I gotta put chapstick on. I really don't know what to say other than <clears throat> today, today is leg, is leg day. day. So I'm kind of excited because I love leg day, so it makes me happy. Also, I was gonna say something else. I know it really just the spider got me up like i don't even want to get out on that side i'm gonna look so dumb i hope nobody's there i'm gonna look so dumb getting out on this side so dumb whoa, whoa. Oh, oh. what song is that y'all since i can't listen to the radio let's see what's that song i just went off so off key just then uh, yeah that song I'm trying to get footage in, like, I don't know, maybe 
Maybe y'all, y'all say y'all want to see a vlog. This is a vlog. This is literally what I be doing. Nah, I'm not gonna lie. In real life, I be just listening to music. And yo, like I'm not gonna lie. I be so much in my head. Sometimes I'll laugh. Like when I'm by myself. Like I'll laugh. And this is why I need tinted windows because earlier when I was driving, a guy literally was staring at me. Literally, he was in front of me and he turned around. Like, he had his window open and he turned his head just to stare at me while driving. So, look, I know, I know people be staring at other people while they're driving. I hate that. So, that's why I need tinted windows because sometimes I be thinking of, like, like funny stuff or funny scenarios in my head or funny memories. And I'll start laughing by myself. Like, I'll literally just, I don't know, where just start laughing very often really or sometimes i'll remember something really embarrassing and i'll just start cringing i'll be like ah. like out of nowhere so yeah, pretty much the fuck it is hot i be putting my my ac so high in the mornings because i be having to take my mom to school to school to work and um you know it'd be cold for me in the morning so that's why we be Damn, it is late. I'm not gonna lie. Like, it's one o'clock in the morning. It's one o'clock in the morning. Conversation got boring. So I woke up in my bedroom and I said, let me go to the gym. So I thought I would wait there. And today is leg day. Just like every other day. Yay. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is how I distract myself, y'all. If y'all wasn't wondering, I'll be, I'll be. I'll just be, bitch, I'll be, for real. All right, I'm here now, and I just realized there's people here, so therefore, good luck to me. And getting out of the car on this side, should I film that? That would be impossible, because then I wouldn't be able to. Come back out. I don't think I'm gonna film it there, y'all. But, woo! Time to get this workout. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's people staring at me. All right, y'all, I gotta go. Bye. Pulse gym teams. Now, we're headed to the bank. Guys, it is currently 2 o'clock in the morning. I didn't want to take too long because, like I said, I know I'm not going to be even able to close my eyes for two seconds and go to sleep because I have to take... Well, my mom didn't call me, so I think I'm good. I have to take my grandparents to the airport, and I gotta go soon, so I know I'm not gonna have time to fucking... I shit, I don't even know if I'm gonna have time to shower. I'm gonna have to shower when I get back from that. But I do have to go to the bank really quick, just to get out of the way, because I don't think I'm gonna wanna do that tomorrow. Tomorrow, I have to go to the gym, too. Um, you know, because I'm trying to get back into, like, the motion of being active, especially at the gym. Um, so that's why. I'm so glad I don't have to work tomorrow. Whoa. Like, oof, thank the Lord. I don't even think I signed my check, so I have to do that. I'm actually excited. Tomorrow I'm gonna make sure I take some time to sit down and take notes on the next topic that I want to talk about. This is a lot of footage. I, I keep trying to remember why. Because I've been editing videos for a long time. I keep trying to remember why I don't like long clips and why I like them short and to the point. It's because when I edit, I have to look through all the footage and see what parts I want to keep and what parts I don't. So when I'm sitting here recording like silent parts, I'm like, ah, uh, now I have to sit here and watch this silent part until I'm fucking dead. I have to sign this check first. So let me do that. Do I even have? Here's all my information. No, I'm just playing. Hopefully it takes this check. What y'all think? Y'all think it's gonna take this check? What y'all think? What do you think? Okay, where do I sign? Because I'm confused. I think I signed here. Yeah, I'm still so scared about that fing choir, but I got so scared about that. Damn, I got too far. Did it even take my sh I'm coming, don't worry about it. Oh, every time I feel something. Alright. 
Thank you. All right, y'all. I don't really have much else to say. So I think I'm going to listen to music now. May. I don't know if I'm going to see you guys again. If I do, I will be ending out the video. Yeah, look at what I have for... It's a clip too. So anyways, why I'm starting to film now, I just got home, is because... And we're actually going to go to my room for this. Is my lash lifted? No. <laughs> why do I feel like I'm I'm like on a ghost hunter show? By the way, I'm using my long ass uh, tripod, but it turns into a small one too. It's like really, really good. So I am usually when I get out of the gym, like I said, I'm just now starting to get back into the motion of like really caring about my little Chi Chi right here. Cause you know, I do have that a lot, but it's been going away because I have a facial massager here. I have a body one too, but this one is for like specifically the face and it vibrates. It usually vibrates. I don't know why it's not vibrating right now. My dog is there. Oh, my back door is open. Hold on, y'all. It's not vibrating. I mean, it, honestly, it doesn't need to vibrate. Y'all yeah, yeah, ain't give, they ain't give me no fucking, um, what's it called? Have you, have you ever, like, had a conversation with your dogs and, like, forgot that they were dogs? Because that's literally me. Sometimes I'll be remembering their dogs, but most of the time I'll be forgetting. Then I'll be like, damn, I forgot I'm talking to a dog. Let me take my head headphones off for this. Because I was going to listen to some music real quick. But I figured since this is a vlog, let me show y'all. After the gym, I always do a body massage and I do a face massage. But obviously, I'm not going to show y'all the body massage because I get naked for that. So on this point right here, you have a drainage point And you have one right here too. And you have so much more, but these are like the main ones for this area. And you just massage it, open it up. It's so much better when it vibrates, but for some reason, this doesn't want to vibrate. Circular motion so it can open up those points. Sometimes it's water weight. A water, I don't know if it's called water retention, but sometimes, because you have to understand your body is ma made mostly out of water. And sometimes, especially in areas where there's a lot of drainage points, it's basically where the water runs to, travels to, and kind of just sits at. So you want to drain that, especially after working out. But I just start massaging the area in circular motions. My body one actually heats up. I made a video about it. It's on my Instagram. Today, I'm just going to do a short one. But, you know, it's just important to keep up with it for me, you know, because I naturally always have it. And I don't want to keep mewing all the time or trying to, like, train my jaw to be a certain way. So this is another hack. It starts to get hot a little bit when I, when you rub it long enough. And then I just start like this. I go down first. You can see what I'm doing right there. What I'm going to do is now I'm going to turn it this way. So I go like this. Then I turn it this way. And I kind of go like this now. And I keep going like that for a little bit. And then I kind of swoop it up. Because remember, that's a drainage point. And then I go all around and I kind of drag it down. All right, and I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Even if it's just for a little bit, this really does make a big difference, y'all. I'm not kidding. I've seen so many good results by just massaging that water out and making sure that water retention isn't there. You know how when you wake up in the morning and your eyes tear up, or at least for me, my eyes, I get tears coming out of my eyes. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Mine is so bad to the point where like my ear water comes out of my ear sometimes. My nose starts running because your eyes, ears, ears and nose, that whole track right there is all connected. And this helps a lot. Even massages in your forehead. When you go like this and when, whenever I have my sinuses really bad, there's sometimes water stuck here too. You massage it down, get water even stuck on your neck sometimes. Massages like that really, really help. There's also one for the body, but like I said, I'm not going to do that on here because I would have to get naked. But if you guys ever want to see me do that, I can. I'll just put like a bikini on or something. For educational purposes, of course. Not for nothing else. Just kidding. Well, no, I'm not just kidding. I'm for real about that, but you know the face I made. I'm just kidding. All right, Jules. I needed that. I wasn't even intending on doing that, but I didn't realize how thirsty I was. All right. All right, y'all. I think that's pretty good. And I am done here.
Okay, so I know you guys can barely see me and probably can barely hear me, but I forgot to film an outro, so I'm filming one right now. <laughs> if you made it this far, if you made it this far to the video, make sure to comment this emoji down below. That way I can let you make it this far to the video. Stay tuned for my next video. I already took my notes, y'all, and my mind is like, like, which is, I'm going to talk about insecurities and shit like that. So, stay tuned for that video, and I think that's it. I think that's all I say. Love you guys. Thank you for everything. I'll see you guys later, and have a nice day.